Women MPs successfully blocked Treasury's attempts to reallocate 420 million shillings allocated for sanitary towels for girls from the Ministry of Gender to the Ministry of Education, Budget and Appropriations Committee Chairperson Kimani Chungwa, while moving Treasury's amendment to the 2019-2020 budget, argued the Ministry of Education had the relevant network to disseminate the sanitary towels to school girls. These sanitary towels are going to girls, our girls, in schools. And therefore, Honorable Speaker, the ministry that has the logistical systems and organization to be able to distribute these sanitary towels is the Ministry of Education, Honorable Speaker. Uh, the CS, actually for gender, actually gave out this back to... Uh, they gave it back to Ministry of Education, knowing very well that the Ministry of Education has the networks to distribute this. But women MPs opposed the move, insisting the money had been put in the Ministry of Gender, where it would be utilized through the Office of Women Representative. Speaker Justin Moturi was forced to read the Riot Act to calm the parliamentarians who were bent on ensuring the proposal did not see the light of the day, constantly interrupting debate. That I know there is a spirited effort by our women legislatures whom we support. That the same way you are able to procure undergrads through the, district, the members, council commissioners, the... you will be able to do the same. Now, now. But I will not allow you to, shout, shout. to just shout from your places. This is never... This is a national assembly, yes. not a county assembly of Homabi. <laughs> it cannot be, it cannot be like that. Or the county assembly of Kisi for that matter. Minority leader John Buddy opposed the diversion of the money, saying the move was polarizing parliament. Why is it so it's so urgent that we have to reallocate it to the Ministry of Education? I don't understand. And I would urge that we let this matter rest and if there will be issues around uh, the, the, the usage of the funds, then next time we can take a different decision. Labor and Social Services Committee Chairperson Ali Wario also opposed the proposal to reallocate the funds. Do we have a role as committee chairs? At what point do our proposal, do our recommendation be changed, Mr. Speaker, sir? I am, I am shocked, I'm baffled, and, and I want guidance from you. The leader of majority, Aden Dwale, would later ask the budget committee chairperson to withdraw the amendment. I will ask the chair of budget to withdraw because he must also respect other chairs. The Auditor General has on several occasions raised budget queries on the procurement procedures in the purchase of sanitary towels. Kevin Washera, Chanoa News.